iwradio.co.uk. Isle of Wight Radio. OK, um, Lindsay, the government is, is looking at allowing learner drivers to learn on the motorway, mm. which at the moment is actually illegal. Yes. What do you think about that? I think it's a fantastic idea. I think it's really good. On the whole, driving instructors and drivers, they want to give them a well-rounded area of the road so they can have the rural the out of town and the only area we can't help them with is the motorways we can do the dual carriageways but there's usually roundabouts or slipways and there's not really a long area to work with so it's a really good idea um, do you think the government has perhaps uh, ignored the Isle of Wight in all of this of course because we don't have a motorway here and how important do you think it is that uh, learner drivers should learn on a motorway? It's very important and I don't think they have ignored the Isle of Wight. I think there is ways and means around it. As Might School of Motoring is a big, big school, we would probably purchase a car to leave on the mainland and then it's just the red jet costs to get over there for a couple of hours on the motorway because it is the experience that is needed and as we all know that um, being slow on the motorway is also a danger in itself and usually when someone has qualified and they get in a fast moving traffic they will want to slow down so it's good experience to be on the motorway definitely. Do you find it surprising that uh, learner drivers here can pass on the Isle of Wight having not been on a motorway at all? No not at all not at all if you think of all the islands in Scotland they've got less amenities like the outer islands in Scotland have got less amenities here we've we've got just about everything to get you through your test and beyond except the motorways but we offer pass pluses which then extends it to the mainland driving you have a day out in the mainland it's really nice and you do lots of motorway training that way and obviously if you've been driving for three years and oh my god I've never done the mainland never done the motorway you could also come back to us and we have motorway training and courses that we can give to the drivers who have been on the road for quite a while so it's not necessarily a bad thing. But on the whole, it would be welcoming, and yes, you and definitely. you would as a driving school. Yes. If if the government did change the law, you'd make it a provision yeah. so you could teach yeah, people on the motorway. We welcome this change. We think it's a fantastic thing to introduce. We really do. Well, let's have a little word with Kathy as well, because Kathy is uh, learning to drive at the moment. So uh, just pop round here for me, Charles, as well. Uh, Kathy, you're you're learning at the moment. Uh, yeah. How would you feel if you were able to drive on a motorway before actually being able to do it on your own? When I th first heard about it, I was really pro it. I thought it was a really good idea because I'm interested in doing the first bus anyway. Um, and then I thought, well, maybe it'll make it more expensive. If it's compulsory, it probably won't help a lot of people on the island. But speaking to Lindsay, it sounds like they've come across the problems and uh, they know what they want to do. So I'm really, I think it's a really good idea that it happens. And as a learner driver as well, do you have uh, future plans perhaps? Do you plan to go to university or, for example, and, and you will end up maybe driving on a motorway? Uh, I do have plans to go to university and I do have plans also to travel on the mainland quite a bit. So that's something that I'm really looking forward to and I think this will help tremendously. Do you find it a little bit frightening or daunting that you can actually pass your test here without having been on a motorway and then like you say you've got plans to go onto the mainland and drive on the motorway? It was a little bit daunting but I think people on the island uh, they have help from their parents or friends and they get by and no I don't think it's too surprising because we have everything else on the island so yeah I think it's okay. The best of luck with your test. Thank you. There we are Cathy and Lindsay thank you very much. Thank you.